Hey, PBR51 here. I'm going to be doing a run of my LEGO Jet Engine. But before I do that, there's been a little bit of confusion of which engines I have and what they're called. So, I'm just going to quickly show you the four engines I have and what I call them. So, we'll start out with this one. You'll recognize this one from the fastest engine on YouTube, 16,000 plus RPM. So, it's just an air engine basically. I call it a turbine, but it's not an actual turbine. So, that's that. Now, here is the one I'm going to be running. It's a Lego jet, is what I call it. It's, an, it's a turbine, and it's from the passenger jet set uh, from a couple of years ago. And I think that set's discontinued, so it's going to be hard for me to get anymore, because that's my last one that's working. And here's my four stroke that I'm still working on. I'll have an update video of this uh out in like a few weeks or so. And finally is the fourth engine. I just built it like a week ago. It's my newest engine. And it's based off one YouTuber's design. I, I can't recall his name, but he showed a video on how to build it. And I'll have a video of this running in about a week. So, there are my four engines. So now let's get to the jet engine. Okay, here's the jet. I'm going to do in just a minute, but before I'm going to show you how it works. So I have it sideways, and what I'm going to do is put a funnel down that hole and pour water in it from a water bottle. The water goes straight down onto the fan blade and it lowers friction and minimizes the wear. And also the water mystifies and comes out the back and it looks like exhaust smoke, which is pretty cool. So I'm going to get the air compressor nozzle and hold it right here in front of it and that's going to cause the fan blade to spin really fast. Probably about 30,000 RPM. But I have no way to measure it because I can't connect it to the tachometer. So I'm just judging by sound. It's probably the fastest one that I have, so that'll be pretty cool. Um, so before I do it, please check out my website. I have a whole page dedicated to these LEGO engines. Uh, I have lots of pictures of this specific one, uh, tips on how to run it in case you have one, pictures of the kind of wear that it gets. Uh, so, yeah, let's go. Okay, it just got stuck. Well, that's the engine. It sounded really fast towards the ending part. So, that was probably definitely 30,000 RPM. And, good thing I didn't break anything. So, I'll pour, post more videos up of it later. So, check out my website. Tell me what you think about it. And, I'll talk to you guys later.